Hey folks, and welcome back to Europa Universalis for the Raid Semantic Expansion as Nobility Controlled Austria. So, in the last episode, I screwed up royally and uh, let the nobility disaster happen, but it's not the worst. I mean, it's no dominance of the clergy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, but it's still bad. It's still. Bild. Um, yeah, yeah. So we're presently a noble republic. Which I guess has its ups and its downs. More morale of armies isn't the worst. Tolerance of heretics. Yeah, yeah. Is a significant loss of points overall, though, so that's a bit of an issue. Uh, let's see. I've got these troops joining together. They're coming across. Good. I'll even change my mind. I'm going to make a client state out of most of Persia. I may do the same for, uh, for Pegu. Regardless, for now... We're just going to focus on sieging down Pegu. I do want to kind of hold on to some points, but I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of development. New university here, right? Yeah, okay. I'm going to do a little bit of development with some of these points we have. I'm still, I'm still looking at getting that to 60 for that achievement. You know, just, just cause. Just because. Actually, now that I think about it, I can, if I'm going to do the client state thing, I can start coring places that I'm not going to give to the client state. There we go. I do want to maintain the ability to maintain a connection of actual, actual, actual Austria through there. So that's a thing. All right. There. I guess there isn't sizable garrison there. Fair enough. But the fort is obsolete, so that helps. Well, that's very interesting. Pegu wants peace. But I'm sorry, Pegu, there can be no peace. There we go. We finished a uh, colony. That's good. Because it was being quite a drain on our finances. Uh, which are in bad shape because, yeah. Because, yeah. Honestly, for reasons no one could have predicted or foreseen or even mentioned to a group of listeners would be a problem. Nope, none of those things are possible. There we go. Alright, Pegu has fallen. Now then, if we want to eat all of Pegu, we can. There's a lot of overextension there. But... I would probably keep Pegu for myself. Probably also here, but then the rest of this area I could give to a client state. And feed start feeding it area over here. I do like the sand of that. Alright, sure. 
I've sold myself on the idea, so we're not gonna actually count and figure things up, because why? Why? Why would we, really? Uh, Khmer, Tongu, they're both gonna hate us, but eh, they're probably gonna hate us eventually when we start taking over their land and causing them problems anyway, so, you know. It am what it is, basically, is what I'm saying. Clarity's influence is now 22%. Right, the nobility's down to 74. So we're getting closer. Your corruption is growing. Yeah, yeah, our corruption is definitely showing. If nothing else. 229.6% overextension. Yeah, we probably need to do something about that. Otherwise, we may have an issue, which would require us to get a tissue. Oh, for the love of, oh, oh, that, oh, oh, I deserve that. <laughs> I, I deserve that. Yes, I do. All right, all right, all right. This is not, this is not the worst thing that's ever happened. Uh, sure, Kerman's fine. Yeah, that's gonna be okay. Sure. There we go. Alright. Alright. Now, the arduous task of giving them land. Yeah, we're gonna give all of all of that area to them. So yes, again, arduous task. This will not be over in a minute, sadly. But that's fine. Give that to them. Kumis. Simnin. Arakan. Arakan. Whichever. I don't feel like I need to hold on to, like, Tehran or anything. I mean, some of these are high-value provinces, but... That's fine. Alright, we'll give you Tehran. I mean, they're gonna be overextended. That's... that's... A thing that's gonna be true. for them is at 50. Let me tell you about overextension, buddy. Let me tell you. Alright, so the wasteland there. Or at least now it's clear and it's wasteland. Come Shiraz. Yeah, I'll actually just hold on to the coast. Bam, 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 bam. This can go to them. This can go to them. All right, good.
Alright, so they're now 67% overextended. It's good for them. I don't trust your numbers. Sadly, I don't feel like I can say for certain what the amount of overextended is, though. Alright, now then. We could just release Pegu. We're releasing Lan Na. I don't think Lan Na is going to be large enough. Yeah, because all this was like 130% over extension. So we've got to do something. Probably still like 150, 160%. Alright, so. Eight, eleven, eighteen percent overextension if we release that and do nothing else. So yeah, we're still gonna have to give more of this away. That's fine. I think. Pretty sure that's fine. Nineteen provinces. Yeah, that's probably a bit much. Alright, Lana. Ravda, that's gonna be fine. Deal, good deal, good deal. Now then, we're gonna give you some land. Actually, let's enforce religion. Well, we're still at eighty one percent, which is not great. I feel like that's about all I can do. 136. Now was that before I did this? I almost feel like that may have been before I did this. That would still leave us over 100, I think. Which is... Poop. Definitely poop. And I'm gonna let it tick for a day. And just see. Still 118%. Damn. Damn and blast. Okay. Alright, well, it 
should be fine. Really. Um, to give say this province away because they are our vassal, right? Just want to make sure we're not cutting ourselves off from our own land. Still 105. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. They're still disloyal, but it won't be for terribly much longer. I don't think, anyway. Nope, nope, nope. We should be in pretty good shape. All things considered. Going forward. There we go. Yeah, 97.2%. Everything's fine. Alright, province is under siege. I did not see the name of that place well enough. There we go. 27. Alright, yep, nope. I guess I guess that amount is fair. I guess that cost is fair. The Mamluks want a marriage. Eh. Is Syria my only march? I believe so. I believe I'm down to just Syria. Okay. I think at this point... At this point, we may be where we can just uh, turn them back into a vassal and look to integrate them. God, the problem is, it's like minus 200 relations. So, yeah. Yeah, we're probably fine. We'll free up a relation slot when we uh, aren't allies with Aragon anymore. We can break the marriage if we really need to. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to be fine. Alright. Now that we've dealt with that, what next? Thank you, Mamlux. We'll go fight the Apache. Hmm. Thing is, they're allied to the Pueblo. For whatever reason, if I remember right. Okay, alright, so part of the Pueblo are in uh, California, part of the Pueblo are in Mexico, and we don't really have a connection there for Austrian Mexico. So yeah, there's that. Oh right, Colombia. Where's my army? Go kill Colombia. Actually, do we even need my army to kill Colombia? I really shouldn't. 
This is this is precisely the thing I have colonial nations to deal with. Fine. 22% influence, really. Oh, other estate and power is minus 40. Okay, alright, alright. That checks out. Seventy-four percent. Still. Wait till the end of the month and see if that's changed. Somebody hates France. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, right. I need to start coring that place. There we go. Yay! Call that diplomat. Truce with Kara is up. Civil War? Civil war with the Ottomans. Alright, so we can curtail the nobility. Which we should. God, that's... really painful. But so it goes. Alright. Change government. I believe I'd become an absolute monarchy? Probably. That sounds like my style. Alright, yeah, become an absolute monarchy. Take some admin power. 160, right, because of our overextension. Yeah, about that. Yeah, alright. I mean, we'll deal with rebels. Nobility curtailed. The Emperor is back in control. The Emperor has a new groove, or something. Regiment successful. Good. Keep converting. Wait, they, they demand how much? Okay. Yeah, they want more land, and that's fine. I believe we can do that for them. All right, Kerman. All right, I gave you my dynasty, so that kind of helps. Just hope it doesn't somehow end up with me screwed over when They become a, a junior an interpersonal union or whatever. Something stupid. Rebels, Moloccan separatists, looming disaster. That's not good. All right, yeah. These things are these these are things which I need to deal with at some point. You know, like the other thing I needed to deal with at some point and then didn't. Yeah. All right. 
Head down there. Yay, natives lose ferocity. Was it a concern? Not really, no. Alright, increase the influence. Yeah, we can give like this to the nobility pretty pretty safely. This as well. Here too. Nine point four, you say. Eight. Ten point one. All right, they're no longer disloyal. I'm feeling okay with that. For now. For now. Hey, fur, cool. Treasure fleets, right, right, beautiful. Hey, because I forgot to declare war on the Ottomans, Iraq broke free. Great. Hey, Iraq. You want to become part of Syria? Asking for a friend, the friend of Syria. Hey, self-sustaining colony. Sweet. Come back over here. Actually, I'll tell you what. Let's bring... Let's recall the colonist. Send him there. Still trying to hook uh, hook our lands up here. That will come a long way. Ooh. It's quite a bit. It's quite a bit. All right, good. Yes, our colonial nations are doing quite well. Congo is allied with Aragon. Colombia is going to be. Fully eaten. There we go. And then I'll tell you what, let's put those troops over here. On the border. On the boardwalk. Down by the sea. Also other words. We're still two years ahead of time. Yeah. 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 No tariffs. Still probably gonna hold off. Or am I? This is not a decision I have to make now. The tariffs are like, not a huge deal. Then again, nah, nah, it's not a huge deal. Alright, yeah. Yeah, this. There's all kind of options still available to us. Right, Iraq. Actually, let's just turn. Independence guaranteed by Kara. You were a touch slow. 
just a touch slow. Yeah, we'll just directly see all this to Syria. Yes, I could go the other way and reduce their liberty, desire, etc., etc., but then I have to click other buttons. That's all of them, right? Yeah, utterly defeated. Sweet. Basra, exceptional year. Yeah, I'll take increased tax. Sounds good. Alright, so we still have a number of concerns. Yes, a large number of concerns. But, uh, yeah, for now... I think I'm going to call this an episode. I thank you folks for watching and hope to see you in the next one where, dear me, uh, where rebels, <laughs> rebels indeed.